a creative art studio unlike any other. A place where everyone can find a sweet escape, artist or not. I myself experienced the magic that is not just paint. Take a look. We do not use brushes. Definitely no brushes. And I'm gonna just say that with a disclaimer, a little foam brush for the background painting of your canvas, but in the artwork, no brushes. No brushes. They are not your usual paint and sip concept. You do not have to be an artist. People think you come to paint and sip and we're gonna paint a cardinal, we're gonna paint an elephant, we're gonna paint a bird, no. They are not just paint. Nearly a year ago, Monica and Gregory Dew opened the St. Peter's establishment with one goal, to make memories and masterpieces. What's the first step? The Creative Arts Studio offers a variety of art and craft instructor-led DIY, from acrylic paint pours to plant and sips. And I want you to make a circle. The dues prioritize creativity and fun. No paint by numbers or pre-sketched canvases. Just you and the paint. Just pour it? Just pour it. Ah. There you go. You can take it home. Mm -hmm. You can love on it some more. It can be a centerpiece on that island, on that kitchen table, a side piece on your nightstands in your bedroom. While the results are incredible, for this dynamic duo, it goes beyond the finished product, too. Just grab it. Grab it. Both sides. Both sides like, like that. that. And pour. And pour. Just shift it. And shift, shift it. it. Shift it. This there, way. See, there you go. This life that we live has a lot of pressures, the bills and the children, and we can keep going on. So many dynamics that people are highly stressed. Mm -hmm. So we're zoning in and our background and our work experiences about mental health and tapping it to everybody is somebody and that everybody matters. Look at it. There you go. Oh, Perfect. Perfect. that's Perfect. getting real oh, crazy see? now. I Look at that. Back. The art studio is a place for all people to come, unwind, connect, and find an escape. It's working and it's beautiful. See, it is. It's so beautiful. And it's something you did. I know, I did this see, all by myself. By no, I didn't... could have been Van Gogh. There you go. <laughs> you know? It is a much needed breakaway, a space of love, creativity, and connection. It really is not just paint. All right, the drum roll, please. Da -da 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 -da. Woo That's beautiful. Stunning, 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 stunning. Put it in the Louvre, put it in the Louvre. <laughs> Stunning! And look, Monica even made me a matching vase to go with my painting. Okay, so I do stand by that this could be in the Louvre. I did look it up. The average cost of work in the Louvre is rumored to be $3 million, which actually seems a little low. So I decided to play a game by asking people at the station how much they think this painting costs without them knowing I was the artist. Take a look. How much do you think this painting costs? Let's see, about $200. $200? Yeah. This looks really nice, very professional. Whoever did it is very talented. $1,000. Really? Yeah. At Target, it would be like $22. I'll say $200. Is that how much? $15. $15? $1,500. <laughs> but I think it could go up to $35. Jokes on them because this painting and the memories I made are priceless. Whether a night out with your partner or a GNO, this is such a fun spot. They even have a selfie room too. Find their schedule of classes or learn how to book them for your parties by visiting kck.com slash show me. Thank you so much, Monica and Greg, for making those memories with me. 